I have another video out called Weaving in Ends that explains to you um, how the real correct way of weaving in an end so you don't lose any elasticity in the work. Now that is great if you're working with an animal fiber or something that's kind of sticky, but there's another trick that I do when I weave in ends for something that's more slippery like uh, cellulose fiber like cotton or linen or bamboo or sometimes even silk. Because wool sticks to itself, when you weave that end in it's not going to go anywhere. Cotton ends will poke out forever and your work could come unraveled if you don't, aren't careful. So let's take a look. This is a cotton dishcloth that I made and I've left an end loose here. And the first thing I'll need is my tapestry needle, of course. I am going to weave in this end away from the edge of the work. Just because it looks better. And even if I'm doing something like a baby sweater, um, I'll get the end away from something that might be bulky or I don't want the little cut end to be out over the edge. I always just move it from the edge of the work. So I didn't do anything fancy there. I just took it up here, like three quarters of an inch. The next thing I'm going to do is to separate the plies in about half and half. This yarn has a lot of plies to it. It might be like an eight ply yarn. Okay. So I have half the plies here, half the plies here. I'm going to thread half of those onto my needle and take it just a half a, I might have leaned into that, half a stitch away. Okay? So now I have my ends coming out from here and here. They're not coming out of the same place anymore. That makes it possible to tie a tidy little knot. And with cotton, you want to be careful, you want to maybe test your yarn, but I know with cotton I can pull really, really hard before it breaks. And the tighter I can pull that, the tinier the knot it's going to be. Okay, that's not going anywhere now. And it is safe to cut that really short. Ta-da! Don't have to worry about it unraveling anymore. And that's the little trick I do when I'm weaving in ends in cotton.